Hey everybody, this is Arathas, and welcome back to Final Theory. So, uh, I played a few extra turns, not many, like I think four, maybe five turns, at the end of the last episode. Basically, I just came and consolidated all the uh, systems that didn't really have anything in them that were of any value. I just kind of wanted them, well, frankly, I just kind of wanted them gone. Uh... Just to, you know, symmetry, make it so my whole territory is claimed. And we're going to keep pushing out against the Imperial Navy. I think they're going to be our biggest uh, threat at this point. Especially since the green guy is still getting slaughtered. And the yellow guy is pushing deeper into the blue dude's territory. So, yeah. So, I think what we're going to do is we're going to push... I think we should go after the bigger fleet over here. Here we go. Take this. And the Imperial Navy's been very nice at giving me all kinds of resources. <laughs> so, we can thank them for how advanced our fleet is. Yeah, we don't want to push our battle cruisers too far forward. Cannot wait to have them maxed out, and then I can start working on the Dreadnought. You can do that all you want, you're still gonna die. Plasma rounds are impressive, but they're not gonna save you. I'm just gonna rip all the shields down. I gotta say, I love the backgrounds too. I haven't really commented on those in the series, but they look really cool. Alright. Move forward and strip the shields. All of them. Leave no shields intact. Can you still reach him? You can. likely to die here. Not from this one battleship, but when this dude gets within range. Maybe not. Yeah. Well, maybe if I deploy the Corvette. We'll see. Really wish you could move farther, but you can't. So, we'll just finish the job. And this is going to murder this. <laughs> For the most part. You know what? We're going to deploy the Corvette. Wasn't going to bother, but... And it'll probably die here in a second. But it'll finish off the... That's a frigate, right? Yeah, it looked like a frigate, not a Corvette. Where are you running to? That is a bold move, just coming right up on my dude. It's not going to pay off. Okay, now it's time to pick off all of this dude's support. I think one of the best ways to do that is just to pull you up here. Plasma blasters on this. Because you can't intercept plasma blasters, can you? Holy hell. I knew it was going to do a lot of damage, but I did not think we were in a situation where it was going to do all the damage. EMP. EMP barrage. Should bring the shields down. And now for thermal. Do it. Nice. EMP barrage on that. Uh, actually, I want you to do a thermal barrage. Move forward a step. 
I'm gonna have you use the MP of Barrage on this thing. Massive amount of overkill, but I do not mind. Thermal missiles. You're not gonna be able to stop them all, so goodbye to you. Battleships are just so beautiful. I don't think I'm going to be able to hit... I can hit you with this, actually. I don't think I can pull back into a position where I can actually hit him. Nope. Just barely off. I messed up my positioning badly. But I can do this to fix it. Let's start with the EMP barrage. EMP cannons. Alright, fine. I still have plasma. And you don't have much of your hull left. I thought for sure we were going to lose a little Corvette. <laughs> but we didn't. Thank you for the research data and everything. Now we can do attack Neum Warhead. Do we want to do attack Neum Warhead? Not quite yet. Kind of do now. I know it's a tiny fleet, but I have no real protection down there. I really hate that they can do that. That they can deploy into systems that have no shipyards. That's annoying as hell. Oh, I thought I was much closer to him. Son of a... Eh. <laughs> okay. It's time to eradicate some fleets. I'd like you to move here. Take this out. Yeah, let's get everybody forward. I think that blue dude's trying to get, trying to lure me into a position where he can use a Tachnium Warhead on me. I'm not gonna give him that satisfaction. I'm also not going to let him just eat up my territory, either. Oh, I haven't used this fleet in forever. It's the one with the, that actually still has a cruiser. He doesn't seem like the primary target, but okay. I'm just glad there's not a carrier. I hate the carriers. They just unnecessarily increase the length of the battles. At least that's what it feels like. You up here. Yeah, let's keep moving you guys this way. I know my battleship still has stuff it can do. I just, if possible, would like him to use all his rounds on uh, unshielded areas. And we didn't get to do that, but that's fine. Those are damn nice guns, though. He should go down right now. You know what I should start doing? I never do. But I should spin up the defensive turrets every time I get them. You cowardly cruiser.
I mean, I appreciate you shooting your own dude. That's always cool. <laughs> One way to go. I'm just gonna keep sending him this way. I want to kill these things. Now, question is can I strip his shields off entirely? I think I can. Thermal guns will finish him. That's about all I can do with that. I can launch some thermal missiles back this way, but they're not going to do much. Okay, I take it back. They're going to do a fair amount, actually. Ah, you haven't used all your guns. Let's fix that. Strip your shields down entirely. This might actually, well, this will definitely kill him. I don't know where this dude thinks he's running off to. Especially don't know what this guy over here thinks he's doing. <laughs> You're not safe, man. <laughs> not as long as that thing's in the area. Holy crap, I didn't even need to use another weapon. <laughs> wow, okay. Let's throw a subspace disruptor this way. The next turn, I'm going to move you down to kill him. And if he moves one space closer, I am going to use a final theory warhead on that bastard. Maybe I can lure him out to do it. Nah. That is one way to take care of him, though. I'm gonna try it. Let's make a smallish fleet. Battleship and a battle cruiser. You have but one purpose. Get within range. And deploy a Tacnium Warhead. I mean, if nothing else, it'll give me something else I can put harvesters in, right? I know that was probably overkill, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm a fan of my overkill. All right, end turn. Nice. That seemed like a borderline suicide run, but okay. Yeah, the yellow guys are just really pushing their advance, aren't they? See, after I take this dude... Do I have any other ships completed? I do not. Okay, so after I take this dude on, I'm going to send him here and then here. Confirm. Take this fleet out. I want no yellow systems in my territory. I am sick of them just basically inviting themselves in. Like I said, it's kind of annoying that they're allowed to do that to begin with. Like, if there was a, if there was an actual station there, I didn't mean to have him stop there. It'd be all right. I think it'd be, it makes sense. 
but they basically break all the rules of the game. Well, to be fair, they move multiple fleets per turn as well, so they're already breaking all the rules, but still. <laughs> Come on, dude. Let's move you on up and open fire on you. Alright, let's unload the plasma cannons on this guy. Crap. Not what I wanted to... Not enough to bring his shields down, which this guy should be able to, though. If not, I really need to consider replacing him. Don't think my battleships need to get super involved here, but they can't really reach anybody else, so why not? Hmm. Well, you... I don't want to do this, but I'm gonna... Son of a... Hmm. Well, we know how to finish him. He does not have the health to survive this. <laughs> uh, stand by, end turn. Wait a minute. Where are his shields? His shields weren't completely gone, I guess. Alright. Time to unleash all kinds of death. I'm going to start with you. We usually don't start with you, but... There go your shields. Can you actually hit him? gonna do over here try to kill him off with just this see if we can't throw an EM barrage over there okay I'm actually gonna move you here because I want this thing dead missiles over here. I'm not going to be able to hit this dude at all from here. I'm not going to be able to reach the enemy. <laughs> uh, that's a shame. Alright, let's break this dude down. Not quite what I was hoping for. That's been happening a lot, though. I want this thing. Thermal missiles. So really, at this point, I just need your shields gone. And then you're dead, because his kinetic cannons will finish the job. Oh, it won't. Well, I still have the means to finish it. <laughs> Next fleet down. As we continue to conquer the galaxy. Cool, he has no more territory to spawn just in the middle. Okay. 
Can I make? Yes, I can. Make a battle cruiser. And turn. Fight amongst yourselves. Yeah, yellow guy is probably gonna make them pay. Yeah, holy crap. Blue dude is losing territory everywhere. Well, let's take this one out. <laughs> Ooh, this is my favorite fleet. <laughs> For very obvious reasons. It's just an entire battleship line. Love having a battleship squadron. Especially Mark 8 battleship squadron. Downside, no EMP missiles or any pure EMP weaponry. Just all plasma. All the time. And plasma is not as effective as EMP weaponry. Uh, for taking out shields, at least. But they're at least okay at it. Shall we? I mean, I really shouldn't underestimate the plasma either. Okay. Right here. And his shields are gone. Can you hit him? And devastating. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure if we'd actually finish him. Yeah, you're fine. Yeah, I don't think you're within range of anything either. I wish we could destroy wreckage. Might as well make their, uh, um, their weapons useless. Yeah, I can't activate those now. Because I already went ahead and told them to go on standby. Alright, dude. I applaud the effort. Now it's time to eradicate the outer ships. Like this. Okay, guns. Kill this thing. And I'm in a good position to use the rest of my weapons on that thing up there if I need to. I don't think I'll need to. Especially since these guys are going to go to town now. defense turret. Plasma! Kinetics. More kinetics. Alright, that's about all I can do. Oh, good... We can just stand by then. <laughs> yeah, that is a 
brave yet suicidal charge. Well, now we can do EMP barrages. It just takes us three turns to get ready to do it. Oh, okay. <laughs> and there goes the frigate. I have no idea how far we are from completing the final theory. Ah, well, nope. Can't upgrade the battle cruiser yet. Another fight or two should do her. Okay, final theory. 6,000 data fragments. How many do we have? Oh, we just need like 500 more. And we don't produce those normally, right? I would, I would strongly advise you against what you're trying to do over there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, no, we don't get any increase without fighting. Okay, that's fine. Let's move down here, because we can... Sure, let's auto-resolve with a full battleship fleet. Did all of them survive? No, we did actually lose a ship. Huh. Well, I'll have to get it back. Hey, okay, cool. That has a fairly nice tachnium deposit. And our battleship is constructed. Our replacement battleship. Mmm, don't do it. There isn't even an enemy fleet there. I think he was just doing it to do it. Like, maybe he's desperate for resources. I don't know. How do we do this? Maybe if I throw out... I mean, I could deploy a bunch of cruisers. An entire fleet of cruisers, though, would not do a whole lot. That's why I'm not doing it. I kind of want to lock their fleet down, though, so... Destroyer. I don't like this dude. Can you keep him away? Thank you. Until I am ready to deal with him myself. Yeah, the yellow fleet is just running rampant. I'm gonna salvage you. I don't need you. Move you up here. Replace your missing battleship. Can I construct another one? And turn. We'll just get closer and closer to that blue dude. I mean, that's a smart move. I don't blame him for doing that. Can't construct another battleship yet, but I can construct, construct a battle cruiser. Let's get in position to play with him. Because as soon as I have access to that system, you're going to die. You got a nice fleet, but it's not going to survive what's coming. I 
and there we go. I can deploy another harvester, so let's do that real quick. Confirm. Take him down. Ooh, he's got a he's got a nice fleet actually. Two carriers, a dreadnought. That probably does mean he's going to spawn an ungodly number of uh, corvettes, which is a shame, but also expected. But we also need to eradicate this as quickly as possible so it doesn't launch any um, other crap. So Mark II Dreadnought, Mark IV, Mark IV, Mark... Really? What you guys been doing? Yep. Oh, he can't deploy one from that ship? Okay. But yeah, we need to make sure that the Dreadnought can't use its Plasma Blasters, which it can do on its second turn, which means it has to die now. It is a... deceptively large fleet. As much as I didn't want to waste my guns on the little dude, which I still don't. <laughs> I can still do that. Alright, plasma cannons on the dreadnought. Ooh, yeah, I'm not killing him this turn. So he is going to get his... Nasty weapon out. Well, that sucks. Well, actually... Might be able to drop his shields and bombard the hell out of him. Uh, with, uh, kinetics. So he might die. Oh, it's looking likely, actually. Oh, hell yes. I keep forgetting that kinetics can still do damage through the shields. Oh, defense turrets. It'd be really cool if defense turrets actually defended the ships next to him. I say this, but if it happened, if the enemy started using that against me, I would not be as happy. <laughs> Bit of a double standard there, I'm aware. Wow, you took out his shields. Hey, dude. Thank you for getting that close. Oh, you can heal him all you want. He's still dead. As are you, my friend. As are you. Not sure this concentrated defensive cluster is a good move against me. Alright, let's start with you. Thermal missiles first. Really? You survived that. Hello? I want this thing gone. Oh, will you look at what I can do now? Kinetics. Might actually kill him with his shield still up. 
Now, what do we target here? How about your destroyer back though? We still got you to play with over here. Plasmas, please. I'll keep using them. All right, fine. And now move around. Pretty much the only ship over here who hasn't gotten in on the fun. Don't think your kinetics can reach it. Oh. I take it back. Still can't kill him. He'll shoot these down. Okay, end turn. We'll descend on the rest of their ships right now, though. <laughs> Trying to save the mothership, huh? Yeah, see, I have defensive turrets, too. We all do. <laughs> I mean, valiant effort. He's almost fully rebuilt. Yeah, those little dudes are keeping them in the fight much longer than they should have stayed in the fight. It's time. EMP barrage on him. Put his shields down. Move here. And put that thing down. Couldn't? Okay, that's fine. Plasma's here. Kinetic cannons. Missiles. EMP barrage over here. It'll probably kill him. Because even though those weapons are basically shield killers, meh. graveyard that we just left here in orbit of whatever planet this is. Excellent. I should be able to upgrade my main, uh, my battle cruisers now. Oh, so close to having the final theory warhead. Come on. Battle cruiser. Commission an upgrade. And we'll keep you guys as balanced. Excellent. I'm pretty sure that's all I can do. Until I find something else to attack. The messed up thing is I don't have any targets in range. <laughs> Wait, isn't there uh, another... No, there's not. I already took out a garrison. So who's nearest to finding a fight? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep moving on up then. You guys don't wanna fight? That's fine. Okay, the blue guy's taken off that way. Just need one more kill. Probably wouldn't even need to be a big fleet, just any fleet. 
Hell, even a small fleet would do. How about we keep chasing him? Don't I get at least a little bit for conquering a system? Yep, I still get 10. I'm just going to continue chasing the yellow dude around the core. If he doesn't come to me, that's fine. Oh, he wants to play. Excellent, then. Let's play. It's not a full fleet, but it doesn't have to be. I was going to get the what I needed anyway. So let's do this. Everybody advances. No survivors, please. And these are all, well, except for the Dreadnought, are fully upgraded line uh, ships of the line, basically. Kind of wish that I'd able to, I'd been able to mass, uh, sorry, max out the Dreadnought. Again, I feel like they do that just to be nuisances. Because those little Corvettes, that's really all they are. If they're just trying to annoy the hell out of you. So I really want to start picking them off early. However, it doesn't matter because our first target... Oh, you have an armor repairer, a shield booster, and a defense turret now. I like that. Kind of wish one of your upgrades was a um, decrease to the amount of time it takes you to trigger your EMP barrage. Yeah, who am I kidding? That's the upgrade I want for my battleships. Oh, he went too far. He can't hit him now. Oh, no, he can still. Okay. Yeah, every, sh every ship, as soon as it gets into the fight needs to bring on its uh, defense turrets. Beautiful. Uh, no. Because I'm pretty sure I would tell you to do this and you're going to hit him more than... Yeah. <laughs> that was the issue. That's fine. Flanking battleships. Good, good. Do what you can to this dude's shields. It doesn't matter if they go down, because you can still get to his armor. Activate. 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 Don't run. It's unseemly at this point in the battle. Like how they're all get they're all trying to cluster around. He's still dead, just so you know. But yeah, they're gonna be able to restore a huge chunk of his uh, she uh, armor right now. Bastards! You were simply staving off the inevitable. Especially when you consider what else is about to happen. What? Well, let's let's focus on you guys. EMP barrage. EMP cannons. Thermal barrage. And he did. Just like that. I'm going to kill off all these little dudes, too, just because they're annoying the crap out of me. Let's go 
for this dude's shields. Bring you over and around. Thank you. Let's move you over here to deal with this nonsense. Still a dead man. Still a dead man. All I need is one missile to get through. Micro jump. Time to take out their next capital ship. And the cannons will finish the job. Oh, they won't this time. Surprising. Well, I still have a way to do this. Let's move you up. Plasma cannons to finish him. Kinetic cannons to rip him apart regardless. Thermal missiles here. Fuel, move you here. Cut off the destroyer. You ain't going nowhere. And now, I think I can finish this dude off. I know he's got his shields up, or his defensive turrets up, but it wasn't enough for the barrage. Ooh, that was satisfying. <laughs> And we can now, wait, what? And the selected fleet into the center of the galaxy to end the war. Let's do it. Am I not capable of? I can't launch a Final Theory warhead. What now? Do I need to be able to move? Oh. Oh god. It's not the end of the game. <laughs> I have to actually fight my way into the core. Now that I'm capable of it. Okay. Okay, that's some bullshit right there. It just gave him one of my systems. Because he did not own that. Oh, you cheating son of a... Alright, fine. Let's go. See what they have in this navy. Oh, wow. This is a crowded section of space. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. He's got himself a big old fleet. I have no doubts that we'll take him out. But I also anticipate he's going to hit like a truck. So I would not be surprised if I lose a ship or two in this engagement. Ugh. Especially with two battleships and a carrier. Yeah, no, he's got a good composition here. But as always, the Dreadnought needs to go first. Stop trying to be the Dreadnought's meek shield. Get out of here. Maybe I should destroy all the little dudes first. Uh, because they can heal the Dreadnought. 
try kinetic cannons. I think the kinetic cannons can... Nice. Kill that thing without me having to waste plasma to bust its shields down. the other weapons to bear then. I feel like I want you closer to up here, but it's not going to happen. So, plasma. Would have been nice if he could have gotten into this gap. Also. Uh, defense turret. Fire. Defense turret. Defense turret. Defense turret. Defense turret. Let's go. I think I'll get through his shields right now. I think this dude can reach. Just barely. Screening him, okay. As long as I can micro warp jump right behind your. Ooh, he thought of that. They're not giving me any leeway to get into his terror, into his, um. Get in on that dreadnought, okay. I see. Okay, then. It's time to fight our way through everything else. Hmm. Maybe let's take out the little dudes surrounding the battleships first. We know they like being a pain in the ass. Thermal missiles to finish you. I think this is a good spot for you. Go for you. I want all the support vessels gone. Almost. Alright. Hmm. Let's put EMK EMP cannons on this. Yeah, his, his stuff has had time to spin up. It's fine. Plasma, can we finish him? We can indeed. I was about to say, really? You didn't have defensive turrets on? So, before you do this to me, that was bad. Hmm. I can hit the guys back here, though. shots are going to just bounce off of him. Well, use your thermal barrage anyway.
Oh my god, end turn. Just listen to the orders. Sure. Keep trying that. Almost there. so much. Oh, you fully restored his shield, essentially. Okay. Nope. We can't allow that. Yeah, you're not getting away. I think I'm going to send all these guys over here. Okay. How about... Plasma on you. EMP barrage on you. And it's a massive EMP barrage. So no matter what you do to stop it, you're kind of screwed. And we're going to cut you off from going, well, anywhere. Uh, let's go with a plasma barrage here. Kinetic guns over here. Move. And auxiliary fuel. We're not going to let him get very far. Alright. Ooh, thermal barrage. Use it. I know you can't get through his shields right now. But I can move you forward. And we can use this. No more reinforcements for you guys. I've had enough. And a plasma broadside for you. I'll use some of these too. Maybe I can kill you. I can. Okay, then. We'll let our Dreadnought do this. And dead. I think this fleet has been most responsible for our, our victories. Like, what is the strength of my fleet? 27-12. And, oh, so yeah, I'm still stronger than they are over here. Final Theory Warhead. Let's do it. And it is only a matter of time after the Final Theory Warhead is launched before the Red Empire conquers the entire galaxy because they don't have fleets to stop me. spreading. Well, that's mildly horrifying. Come on, pull it in. Be 
sucking my fleets in. So I think a mistake was made. A horrible, horrible mistake. That is a really cool effect, though. Okay. Did, did, did we destroy the galaxy? <laughs> Successful detonation of final theory. The worries of deploying such a weapon were indeed founded. The extent of the subspace collapse proved far greater than anticipated, but the resulting deposit exceeds imagination. The old empire is no more, and the new dawn awaits as we look at our skies remade. What was lost will be rebuilt in time, but was gained as the future of our people. The intergalactic age is about to begin. Huh. Six hours, 228 turns. Nice. Star systems destroyed by the final theory. Unknown. Okay. Well, it looks like that is the end of the game. Uh, we figured it would be. And yeah. That, this has been a really fun game. I kind, kind of wish that... There were reasons to deploy the smaller ships aside from money reasons like for example maybe if the ships had upkeep or if the ships smaller ships were built in fewer turns than larger ships like for example the dreadnought i feel is weird that it takes a dreadnought three turns to be built the same amount of time it takes a frigate to be built that's kind of odd to me uh as a result it's like just save up your money and get the bigger ships and ignore the smaller ones after a while but still Overall, it was a lot of fun. I really liked also the fact that because the enemy can launch final um, Tachnium missiles, I love that you always had to be careful getting your fleets too close to the enemy. You didn't want to get close enough that the enemy could move and be adjacent to one of your fleets, because then, for all you know, you just lost an entire fleet to a Tachnium warhead. So yeah, I really enjoy this game. But with this, though, that's all the time we have for today, so thank you everybody so very much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video at all, then please, by all means, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, or any combination of those actions that suit you today. And, yeah, I'll see you guys next time for whatever game takes the place of this. Thanks for watching uh, both the episode and the series.